broadcast. ICT Cabinet Secretary Eliud Owalo now says that the digital identity that will replace Huduma Number will be voluntary to all Kenyans and no one will be forced into the process. Unlike the Huduma Number, Owalo said once the government rolls out the process, it will be optional. While highlighting the ministry's achievements for the last one year, Owalo said the ministry had achieved a lot including creation of 174 digital laboratories across the country that are currently being used to create digital jobs to Kenyan youth. The digital identity we are talking about is not the same thing as the Oduma number, both in terms of objective and context. We also clarify that when it comes to pass, we will not force any Kenyan to take a digital identity. No. The onus will be on you to decide whether or not you want to consume government services through your digital identity based on your biodata or you want to physically visit government offices. Our target here is 25,000 free Wi-Fi hotspots all over the country. And the objective is to ensure that those Kenyans who are operating at the bottom of the economic pyramid are supported by government to get access to internet. We are also rolling out 5G. We'll have just over 800 sites by the end of this calendar year. We're going to put another 1,000 uh, in the next couple of years uh, so that uh, we, we 